Hey, guys, um, something happened to the Millcraft server, and, well, to say the least, the entire Millcraft server was burned. All of it was burned. We, we here's some rem we've had to rebuild that. Animals died. Bridge was burned. Tom's shop was destroyed. My house completely gone. Some glass was broken too. Yeah, so people, real people did it, and it wasn't just like a lightning bolt. Real people did it, and they. Here's the thing. They tried to pin all of that damage. That there's still there was a giant house here at one point, and and here's the thing. They tried to pin all of this on someone. Can you guess who? Well, you. Well, there is a nice shot of actually guessing, but right around this area, they put up a sign that said Alex four one zero six was here. Do you guys remember who Alex 4106 is? I'll give you a second. It's me. So they tried to pin it on me. The, all of this, they tried to pin it on me. They didn't do their research. If they did their research, they could have um, maybe done it successfully, but they they didn't do any research into this. They just griefed this entire server and now we're taking extra pre precautions because of this so might be a little harder to join Millcraft now um, later when I have time I, I think um, the joining system needs a re rehaul uh, an over thing if you will see Tom shop was destroyed some of my items were also stolen. Don't know if they were stolen, but I, I think they were stolen. Hey, you guys remember my ore chest? I had 30 blocks of iron gone. I also think the person that burned down Millcraft was this person, because, I don't know, maybe, maybe they were angry that um, this house is in a illegal building area. Maybe. As far as I know, they haven't destroyed it, our bases. So, at least they didn't destroy our bases, because, yeah. But they, but they did steal a couple items from me. Maybe they have a base underground somewhere. Did they even destroy this? There's no point in destroying that. The bridge, yeah, I can understand why you destroyed that, because of transportation and stuff, but... Really? Like, like the bridge? Of all things? You, you guys didn't even check my basement that well they must have just opened up a random chest and found a couple enchanted books cuz well hold on let me get over here cuz I have this chest just sitting there I'm not sure if I want to just leave it there anymore after what happened don't know if I trust absolutely all everyone but I trust some of the older members for sure like Tom for example I, I trust Tom and some other members. All the chests gone. When I came back here, um, let's see, I was here. My cat survived. He's right there. There was broken glass on all levels. The upstairs was completely gone. There was a couple blocks just floating there. But but I was so happy because I had a lot of good stuff down here. They they didn't really touch it. But they did steal a couple enchanted books. I had four. Now I have two. So, yeah, a couple were stolen. So, yeah, some, some were stolen. The trees we cut down to rebuild. Um, spruce was given to me by... Um, I don't, I don't remember your gamer take, I'm sorry. Is this for the horse stables, right? I'm guessing it's for the horse stables. Guessing. They didn't touch the mob grinder, though, luckily. But otherwise, they burn down, like, everything. And Tom does think this is a great time for revenerating the place. So basically, changing the place up, yes, I do agree with that. We can definitely change it up. But because of this one attack, which I'm going to call the burning incident, is, I think, what some would call a terrorist attack. They didn't touch this place, though, which I'm happy about, because... 
Tom spent a lot of time working on this, and, well, you don't really want to build another one. As long as he didn't destroy the spawner, we're fine. Yep, there's a spawner. And there, there's a drown. Let's get my pickaxe back up. Oh, no, Nautilus shell, look at the hat. So, it is a sad time in Millcraft history. Definitely a very sad time. Um, so, my friend does want to join Millcraft, and he wants to join at a pretty bad time. Because we're experiencing... <gasps> All the slime balls are gone. I, I had a giant shop basically ready to go of slime balls about a stack and a half of slime balls ready to make a slime ball shop but then I realized just now they're gone every item upstairs is gone I'm only storing stuff down here now and, and I'm gonna have to make like some type of hidden area cuz I don't know if I trust absolutely everyone well I, I don't remember who's all here anymore either so yeah Glass was broken, people, real people did it, they must have just been lighting stuff on fire, they must have held it too long on this when they were trying to burn stuff. Then they, then they tried to pin it on me. Sad. And here's some more glass I was making. I'm just happy they didn't really take any items that are too important. Like, they, they easily could just have a base hidden away somewhere. And I think they do have a base hidden away somewhere. I, I do fully think that they have a base somewhere. You know, they were going to try and pass the blame off onto me. And take all the items they had stored up. And use them slowly. Or use them all at once. So... I, I do believe that they have a hidden base, like, underground or something. Somewhere. So, yeah, I, I do believe they have a hidden base somewhere. With some items. Like, the diamonds. You you have to look through people's stuff if you're going to grief. You have to. If you, if you don't, you aren't griefing right. At least that's what I've learned from YouTube. Like, you look through people's items so you can grief more. At least... That's what YouTube has taught me. With watching in early days of Minecraft on how to grief tutorials. Oh, I remember I was griefing my own world. It was it was really fun. Like grief on your own world by yourself, but don't grief any other people. Just just grief your own world. Don't grief other people's realms or servers. Okay. Please produce, like, some baby. Because I, I, I need, like, some stuff, please. Hmm. So, the, the burning incident, um, is still, um, being worked on. Still being fixed. After all the damage that has been caused. Um, we're all broke, basically. Sponges from the... Uh, sea monuments have been saved. Thankfully, Tom was using them for something, so they were saved, at least. So, we, we don't have to worry too much about getting more sponges. But, I'm just sad. Like, come on, pe people. You, you should be better than that. So, um... See you guys later. Um, the burning incident might cause Millcraft to be on hold for a little while. It might. I do not know if it will. It easily could stop uh, Millcraft for a little while if I'm not feeling too hot still. Anyways, I'm, I'm going to try and locate this treasure. See you guys. I, I, I don't know when, but... This has been a strategy for Millcraft history. We'll remember this for seasons to come.